Alright, hey guys. I'm back after a pretty long break. But, uh, yeah, I got this new program called RPG Maker XP. And, uh, I wanted to show you guys something that I got stuck at some time ago, and I figured out it's going to be how to make and use a door. So, I already have this thing set up. So, what you do is right click event, <laughs> then you need to go to um, graphic, go down the door, make it whatever door you want, then click page one, control self switch, self switch A and on. And then now, new event page. Do the same, go down the graphic, and make it the second one this time. And then turn self switch on, A is on. And then double click here, control self switch, and turn it to B on this time. Now, new event page. Do the same thing again door, the next door down, turn self switch on to B this time, then do double click, page one, control self switch C this time. Now lastly we need a new event page, go down to last door, the last picture of the door, turn self switch C is on. Now go back, go to control self switch and turn A off. Then do it again and turn B off. And then one more time and turn C off. So now you have the doors. But first you need to go to page 2, 3, and 4 and turn it to auto run. This will make it so when this scene happens, these three will also happen. Now hit apply and OK. Now what you need to do is make a new area, map, whatever you want to call it. And just make it whatever you want and then go back to the door, edit event. If you want to have a sound effect, go to double click event command go to page 2 play SE and go to the door right here there's eight of them but I'm gonna pick number one now after you have that double click again go to page 2 transfer player click this go to your whatever map you want and click anywhere on the screen and it will automatically tell, uh, teleport you there so I'm going to put it right here hit OK OK apply OK and then I'll try it out alright so let's try it out yep it seems to work perfectly so uh, I'll see you guys later.